Hello guys, this is Manhar Gupta again with a review of Camera Next Mode. This app is developed by Abhi Gandhi, a senior developer in XGA. And this app is basically made by Abhi for OnePlus One. And this app is really good app as you can see it lying on the center of the screen here you can see this app is ported for you eureka by prathamesh and is posted in the forums the download link is in the descriptions below and for flashing instructions you can watch my earlier videos now coming to the app the camera next mode this app is basically developed for oneplus one this app is basically developed for oneplus one to take better pictures compared to the stock camera app and this app is very well ported for you eureka by prathamesh you can see the app here it's basically based on cyanogen camera app this app has features similar to the basic cyanogen stock camera app you just can change the mode by swiping the screen you can change the mode in which you have to take the pictures further new options are added in this camera app like you can change the effects and very new effects are added like fireworks or other and other effects are added in this camera app Further coming to other features of this, you can change the ISO and auto ISO is by default in this camera app. You can change the ISO according to your needs. You can change the exposure like this. Now coming to the quality, you can change the quality of the picture according to your needs like you can change to 85 percent if you have to take super fine pictures which i prefer the most you can change the storage mode where you want to store the images like in the sd card or in the internal storage now coming to other features that are introduced new in this app first feature the slow shutter speed as you can see you can change the shutter speed to a great extent for example to show you this is the default shutter speed and it is actually very fast so if you want to take pics at slow shutter speed you just have to select the best according to you and you can see the shutter took a bit more time compared to earlier now coming to other features the best feature of this app is denoise feature this camera app clicks picture and denoise it by default and which is a very good feature and helps to improve your pictures by a great extent for example you can see in here this is a picture taken by a default camera app the stock camera app I will say you can see the noise here and the same pic taken by this camera next mode app you can see you don't will not see any bit of noise in this picture Now coming to other features like the focus mode you can change the focus mode this feature is also present in the stock camera app you can change the auto exposure to centrally weight and other options you can change the auto focus zone you can change the sharpness according to your 
according to your needs it helps you take very crispy pictures like you can do with DSLR you can add color effects to your camera now this feature skin tone enhancement if you are a selfie orientated person or you take your pics or you take a lot of your pics this can help you improve your skin tone the red the red eye reduction this is also a good feature if you take very serious pictures and as I do histogram is also another feature that is introduced in this camera app and another feature use 50 MP instead of clear image is also there now these features are not that useful but these are introduced by the developers now you can change the size of the video according to your needs like you can have a 720p video recording or 1080p video recording you can record slow mo camera slow mo videos you can record slow mo videos at 60 frames per second you can change the video du duration you can change the audio codec video stabilization is by default enabled in this and video HDR is also an option to record videos very stably color effects are also there and these can be introduced in the videos and these color effects are also very nice to use now coming to general settings you can change the general storage settings to internal storage or SD card you can enable power shutter to take pictures you can enable volume keys to be used as zoom keys left hand arrangement can be done you can enable bright screen you can see in here this app is modded by abhi08638 xda v10 infinity plus and boot mgr this was all from me you can see it focuses really fast and takes pic really fast the video mode is also there and it takes really good pictures you can see in here the details you will not be able to see any noise in this images thank you Abhi Gandhi for making this app and thank you Pramit Prathamesh for porting this app to Eureka thank you for watching this video for flashing guides do watch my other videos hit a like and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching this video